My name is Randy Bowling, and I work for EQ Systems. And today, we are going to discuss how to set the orientation and null on your EQ Smart Level touchpad. For this example, this touchpad, when you look at it, you're looking through the windshield of your coach or through the front of your coach. So when you set the orientation and the null on this one, the first thing you want to start with is with the touchpad turned off. To set the orientation, push and hold the all retract button with one hand, push and release the power button with your other hand, your touchpad will turn on and start beeping at you. Let go of the all retract button, and then for this situation, push and release the front up arrow, because the touchpad is standing up and it's looking through the front of the coach. Now to set the null on your leveling system, you're gonna push and hold the auto level button with one hand, push and release the power button with your other hand. The touchpad will turn on and start beeping at you rapidly. After five or six of the rapid beeps, let go of the auto level button and you'll hear a different tone beep. This is another example of where a touchpad can be mounted in a coach. When you look at this touchpad, you will be looking through the rear of your coach. To set the orientation on this touchpad, start with the touchpad off. Then push and hold the all retract button with one hand, push and release the power button with the other. Then release the all retract button and push the up arrow for the rear. This will set the orientation. Then you will need to set the null. Start with the power off, no lights lit. Push and hold the auto level button with one hand. Push and release the power button. Still hold auto level. After you hear five or six of the rapid little beeps, let go of auto level and you will hear the acknowledgement beep. Here is another example of where a touchpad can be mounted. It is mounted behind the driver's seat. So to set the orientation on this one, you're going to push the up right arrow. In this example, the touchpad is mounted above the entry door of your coach. So to set the orientation on this touchpad, you're gonna push the left up arrow. For this example, the touchpad is laying down in the driver's armrest. Most commonly, this is going to be on diesel pushers or class A units. So when you set the orientation for this touchpad, you're going to hit the down right arrow. So in recap, whenever you're setting the orientation on your EQ touchpad, it depends on which direction it is facing. So if you look at your touchpad and you're looking through the front of your coach, first thing that you're going to do is push and hold the all retract button push and release power, the touchpad's going to turn on and start beeping at you. You're going to let go of the all retract button and you're going to push and release the up front arrow. If the touchpad, when you look at it, it is facing the rear of the coach. So when you look at it, you're looking through the rear of the coach. You're going to do the same thing. You're going to push and hold the all retract button, push and release power. The touchpad is going to turn on. You're going to let go of the all retract button and you're going to push and release the up rear arrow. Now, if the touchpad is mounted behind your driver's seat, you're gonna start with the touchpad off. You're gonna push and hold the all retract button, push and release the power button. The touchpad's going to turn on, let go of the all retract button, and you're gonna hit the right up arrow. Now, if your touchpad is above your entry door, you're going to push and hold the all retract button, push and release power, the touchpad is going to turn on, start beeping at you, let go of the all retract button, and you're going to hit the left up arrow. Anytime your touchpad is standing up like this, you're always going to hit an up arrow. If your touchpad is laying down, you're going to hit a down arrow. So in the scenario of a diesel pusher or a class A, a lot of times they will mount the touchpad in the armrest of the driver's seat. So when you set the orientation up for that, you're going to push and hold all retract, push and release power. The touchpad is going to turn on, let go of all retract, and you're going to hit the down right arrow. If you have any questions, please visit us at eqsystems.us. Thanks.